hello now we are in our video number 26 so uh, the video the content in this video is about the interior setup of the aquarium so I just want to share a few views of mine regarding the interior setup uh, actually we maintain the aquarium for our happiness and the major attraction in that is the fish which lives in it <coughs> actually the fish enhances the beauty for the aquarium apart from that if possible live plants and apart from that interior setup means some toys or uh, artificial toys or some carvings something sort of things which we can get from the aquarium store so I want to talk uh, what I want to share with you is for example if we are having a small aquarium and uh, if you have if you are having more fish and if you want to make or if you want to enhance the beauty of your aquarium by adding a uh, few more uh, interior decorations please keep in view that uh, we have the right to keep the aquarium but at the same time we don't have the right to trouble the fish before going for the interior decoration or so sort of things please keep in mind to which extent uh, your fish will feel comfortable uh, with the toy because it has to roam it has to move freely but it shouldn't, it shouldn't feel the toy as an obstacle. For example, if you're in a bit busy or traffic road, if you're in a traffic, a pedestrian can walk freely through the traffic, whereas a two-wheeler can also move freely, but a little bit tough when compared to the pedestrian. Whereas it comes to the car, uh, it becomes a bit, a little more tough for the car to move in the traffic when it comes to a huge vehicle it will be obviously tough for the huge vehicle to move through the traffic easily in the same way there are many types of fish for example if you can take wild fish or a wild fish which are of small size though they have little space they can move easily through every corner of the aquarium or the decorations and such sort of things but for example, if you take some goldfish or some such sort of things, they need a, a bit spacious uh, environment to be in. If you keep all these uh, decorations and if the tank size is small and still more fish are added to that, every fish will feel uncomfortable moving in that aquarium. So please make sure that it, it not only uh, enhance the interior decorations will not only enhance the beauty of the aquarium but should also enhance the <coughs> lifestyle of our fish and uh, one more session I want to tell you is each and every decoration uh, most of the aquarium interior decoration items stay on the bottom of the aquarium okay so as we have discussed about the types of fish in types of fish there are bottom dwellers of the aquarium middle layer dwellers and the top layer dwellers in the aquarium so when you go for more of uh, decorations and uh, if lot of space of the bottom space is covered with decorations i suggest you please do not opt for uh, bottom dwelling fish or go for a very limited fish and for the small size fish so that everything every animal or every fish feels comfortable uh, moving around in the aquarium so that, that is what I want to share with you in this video and our next video is going to be video number 27 and there we are going to talk about selecting the fish that is final selection for example uh, what is the final selection of the fish?
so let's talk about that in our next video that is video number 27 and until then